Greetings, people of Earth, and welcome to Minecraft 1.11. Uh, if you look up in the top left, you can see that we are in Minecraft 16W39A, the snapshot that came out just today, and uh, there's a whole bunch of new stuff, and I'm going to be going over that with you guys. If you like the new format, then, uh, well, not new format, but if you like this kind of a video, yeah. So, I forgot to clear out my inventory, but as you can see... Re-added spawn eggs. So there were some spawn eggs that were removed in the last update, and they've been re-added in, and those are the wither skeleton, the mule, the skeleton horse, the zombie horse, the donkey, the elder guardian, the stray, and the husk. So now in creative mode, you can get these eggs. Also, we'll get to what that is in a second. Okay. Oh, they do have a noise. So, new items were added in. Uh, let me just grab the wiki here. I'm not used to this, so I'm not very prepared, but... Added in were the shark, sh the shulker shell. That is a tongue twister and a half. Drops from shulkers, and you can craft it with a chest to turn into these shulker boxes. Uh, the totem of undying, which drops from a new mob called the vindicator. No, sorry, drops from the new mob, the evoker. Uh, saves your life when you get a killing bro blow, and uh, gives you regeneration and absorption. Um, makes a particle like the Elder Guardian thing, so it like pops up in front of your screen, but it won't save you from uh it won't save you from slash kill or falling into the void. So next is the Ocean Explorer map, which if we use it right here, that shows us where the nearest uh water guardian temple is. So that's pretty cool. And there's one more called the Woodland one, which I'll show you in a second. This pig's my assistant. There were new commands added in. Uh, slash do slash game rule do weather cycle will say that the weather can never change from what it currently is. Uh, slash do slash game rule max entity cramming. Uh, basically, if a let me just check here. Yeah, if an if an entity so like it, let's say this pig tries to push twenty four other pigs, it'll start suffocating. But if you change it with this command, you can change what the max limit is. Also slash locate uh, structure will show the nearest village or dungeon or whatever. And then we have splash text. So when you load up the game, there's that yellow text that appears on the title screen, and there's new ones. One of them says Javalicious Edition. Another one says Should Not Be Played While Driving. And the last one says You're Going Too Fast. There was also a whole bunch of other like code and fixes and bugs and all that that they ironed out, so I just thought I'd put that there. And as for gameplay, you lose a lot less hunger when you're like sprint jumping around and fighting, but when you're healing, you lose a lot more. And those are the items and the new commands and stuff. Pardon the villagers that are all around. That's because I was doing something. So I have these in their boxes because, well, you'll see. So this is the Vindicator. Uh, he... Let's spawn him in here. Boom. There's the Vindicator. He looks pretty awesome. He has an iron axe in his hand that he just doesn't want to take out for some reason. He he is an outcasted villager, so he really wants to murder this villager who kicked him out of his village. He has an iron axe, he's hostile towards me, he gets his hands, he spawns in the new woodland mansions, and he drops emeralds. So, let's see. Drop me emeralds. Uh, diamond sword. Drop me emeralds. Oh, look at that. He drops emeralds. So next we have the cartographer, which is in a box because I thought it would work, but it didn't. So I named him Map Guy because he sells you the maps. So this is the Woodland Explorer one. The other one is the Ocean one, and I already showed you that one. So let us grab a compass from here, and I already have the emeralds, so we can do this. We want the Woodland Explorer map. And then we can look at that, and it'll show us where the nearest Woodland Mansion is, which is pretty cool. Next is the Evoker, and the reason I didn't spawn this guy in earlier is because uh, if you did, well, he does this. Do it. Yep, cast his magic -y magic, his little fairy things, which are the, the new mob called Vexes, uh, murder the villager. And they look pretty awesome. They're like little fairies. They spawn by the evokers. Uh, they can fly through blocks. They, uh, let's see, they are hostile towards players. And when they're about to attack, 
the the texture changes to red. I don't know if I caught that, but it does. And they make awesome noises. They look like what? Oh, what is it fighting? Oh, they're fighting other villagers. Turn red so I can see. Yeah, so you see that they turn red and then they beat the crap out of things. Whoa! What was that? Oh, right. Okay. So it can summon a stream of fangs that come up out of the ground and eat things. Why are you dying? Farewell, friend. Um, so that's the evoker. Pretty awesome. And then! Llamas! Guys, there's llamas in this game now. These guys are terrifying. Um, so... You can saddle them with a carpet. I noticed he took an incredibly long time to tame. I don't know why, but he did. Uh... You can, you can ride them, uh, but they don't listen to you. They don't listen to you at all, and they're incredibly slow. But, when you put them on a lead, you can see they're quite quick. They can, they can carry your, they can carry stuff for you in their chests like a donkey. And if we bring this out, you can see that if I just go like this, they all form a caravan, right? So you can see that they all line up and travel with you. And they travel quickly enough that the lead won't break. So you can put chests on all of them. And then just have a walking storage compartment. I'll, uh, I'll get a good upwards angle of this. So you can see if you get too far away. Wait, what? Come here. No, okay, so the tracking on these guys is really good. So they won't, uh, they won't, they won't just leave you. Um, they do have a spit attack. Where, oh, I knew I should have left the spawn eggs for those mobs in there. Where, no, I don't want to spawn a llama. Uh, game mode zero? If we go into survival mode, he'll spit at me? Yeah, there it was, so he spat at me. Ouch! Okay, that's enough of that. We've proved our point here. And, uh, yeah, they'll do that to mobs also. Uh, so... That's a new thing. Oh, right, blocks. So, there's two new blocks. Uh, well, actually, there's a whole bunch, but there's two types of new blocks. The Observer, which is a redstone contraption. I don't know how to do redstone, but it came from Minecraft Pocket Edition, I believe? Yes. Came from Windows 10 Edition or Pocket Edition. Uh, it detects block updates and outputs a redstone, redstone signal. Then you have the Shulker Box, which is an awesome thing that you craft with the shulker shells I showed you earlier and chests and they you can't open them while they're on top of things but when you open them they have this awesome like shulker animation which is really cool um so let's see they whoa wait what a, statistics that's a new thing oh so now you can see all the things you've done that's very interesting anyways uh, they, so a dispenser can place them, they break into item form, the top spins up, like I just said, and will carry you up with it. Uh, they don't drop contents, but what? No way! So it just said there that when you break, guys, can you put a shulker box? In a shulker box? Oh, you can't, because that would be infinite storage. But it tells you what they have in it, and I accidentally just cloned it. That's super cool. That reminds me of a mod that I've played with before. Uh, so next, after the blocks, we have... These guys, which were a zombie wither skeleton and a... Uh, zombie wither skeleton and a... Uh, shoot, what was it? Hold on a minute. Come on. Uh, right. Zombies and creeper. Creeper, that's right. Okay, so. Creeper. Wither skeleton. And zombie. If we grab out this shield here. We can put it in our offhand slot. And go into survival. So before, shields would block 66% of the damage dealt. Now they block 100%. Creeper damage. We'll do exactly 0%, which is cool. Uh, wither Skeletons, before, they would give you the Wither debuff when they hit you, but now they won't. What are you trying to do there, bud? You trying to hit me? 
Okay, you can. And zombies that don't have anything in their hands can no longer damage the durability of it. Oi, fight me. Oh, also, if they're on fire, it used to be that they would light you on fire when they attacked you. Break. See? So now he can't light me on fire. Alright, so that's cool. Uh, it shows your hunger bar now when you're in a boat or a minecart. Um, and there's some bug fixes, like I said before. But that's about all for the new 1.11 snapshot. I'm super excited for this to come out. And uh, I hope you all did enjoy as it starts to rain. Farewell.